Now, the period of Dravidian identity, it takes about 100 years to create this. First is, in the beginning, they demonize the Tamil people. They call them inferior. They say South Indians are vilified as immoral, ugly, and stupid. This is what Corbyn writes. Many, many times he writes this kind of stuff. Then he starts saying that South Indian mind is structurally distinct from the Sanskrit mind. Then he says the classic Tamil literature, the Sangam era, is glorious and not like the rest of the Indian literature. So he gives them a separate identity. And then, they, then he constructs something called pure Tamil religion, which he says Aryan Hindus colonized the Tamils to impose caste and, and immoral rituals, but there used to be before that happened a pure, uh, a pure Tamil religion. And then he Christianizes it. He says the Sangam era Tamil religion, he co opts it as part of early Christianity. He begins to say that the dates of the Sangam era are after Christ. And actually, it's the early, the Thomas Christians, St. Thomas, and all these guys came and they brought these ideas into Tamil. So, the original, he's telling the Tamil people, originally you were like Christians. And these Hindus have turned you into pagans and heathens. So, he's trying to bring not only racial divide there, but also Christianity in there. Okay. And then, uh, the, uh, then the, the advice that uh, Hindus and Aryans are the enemies and the advice is that Sanskrit should be removed from Tamil culture, any traces of Sanskrit. So they are going and reclaiming like Mahabalipuram is now renamed as some, the Tamil equivalent and so on. So this is part of a movement started 150 years ago by these guys.